time and time again, I meet a new client and they say to me, Alan, I know I need an agreement with a client, but I want you to make it just a paragraph. My response is, go out, shake hands with the client, and good luck. Having an agreement that doesn't contain all that it should contain is more dangerous in many instances than having uh, no agreement at all. Um, and, and quite frankly, the, the length of an agreement, and here with the ASID letter agreements we're speaking of just a few pages, usually that concern is, is the, desi the designer's concern, not the client's concerns. Clients very rarely balk at the number of pages contained in an agreement. What they balk at are unfair, unreasonable terms, or it doesn't reflect the business deal. But clients don't walk away from agreements. Uh, the design profession in the past has, in many ways, been largely hesitant, thinking that uh, clients won't sign an agreement. Well, if I were a client, I would expect you to be presenting me with a letter of agreement. It establishes your professionalism, and quite frankly, it's the right thing to do.